everybody, this is Praxis, and today I'm on site with my dad, and we are doing hopefully the last uh, couple days of electrical work. What I'm working on right here is an area that's right behind what would be like a monitor for like movies or video games or whatever. Uh, I'm putting a box set into the wall, uh, and I'm going to have uh, power available here, and also a cable here that would run a uh, you know, video signal uh, that we would want to get over uh, in this direction. I think I'm also going to put a little speaker wire in case you ever want to have a speaker on this wall. The reason for that is that while normally you'd have you know a monitor and then uh, you know decks below it, you know DVD player, whatever, Blu-ray player, and that. Uh, Putting it here, it's kind of in the way, because this uh, is kind of a combination media room slash hallway. There's going to be a lot of people moving through here, and, you know, to get upstairs. And if you had a bunch of things here, you know, everyone would always have to go around them. Now, you could save about three inches by setting them into the wall a little bit. If we made a box into the wall, you could kick them in, uh, you know, three inches or so. But still, they'd be sticking out into the room. So, what I want to do is have all that stuff over here and have the signal kind of run over here. It takes about 30 feet of HDMI cable. My dad and I kind of figured out the route and I measured it out uh, to, to bring it to here. So, you know, we're going to be doing that later, but I'm working on the box that's fitting in right here. Um, I just did a couple of uh, three-quarter inch boards here. Uh, I got them all measured out. And like I said, the power is going to go in here and the HDMI uh, jack is going to be here. Now, you could just run a wire through the wall, you know, have one end plugged into the back of your player, one end plugs into the back of your monitor. But uh, the reason I'm not doing that, I'm going to run them to a plate, is because, you know, if you're ever plugging it in and you bend a pin or something like that, then the entire wire would need to be re-pulled and replaced. Or I guess you could take off the head and, you know, go through the trouble of, you know, kind of fixing that. But if you can have a static, untouched wire in the wall, and then you can replace the plate, or you can replace the shorty cable. Uh, it just makes it a lot easier for when things inevitably break, because things always do eventually. Uh, what I'm, I'm just about to do right now is to put this uh, electrical box in, and uh, as I was getting the materials ready here, I realized I might have a little bit of an issue uh, with the angle of the drill going in here. I don't know if I have a, uh, a shorty screwdriver that has a really tight point. Uh, for these guys, oh, and I keep the, uh, the extra sharp screwdriver bit for driving these, I keep it in the box with them, so it's always there when I want to use them. That's all, all I use this bit for. All right, so let's see, I, I bet I can get the ones in at least on this side, but on the, on the far side, I don't know. I'm not sure, we'll see. Let's see. All right, no worries on this one. Okay, that's one. The other thing that's going on today is I got a really stiff neck. I don't know, like the coldness of the weather came in or whatever. It's uh, not fun. But I want to get at least something done. You know, sometimes you might feel like you want to just take the day to recover, but uh, you know, I want to take the day to get more done. Okay, yeah, this is going to work out. It's going in at an angle, but that's actually beneficial for these anyway, having them kind of splay out in angles a little bit. It helps you grab better, because these are short screws. There we go. So we're going to be uh, uh, rerouting power. Instead of running the power directly to here, we're going to be running the power to here, and then that'll fly down to there. And then HDMI cable comes around, and then eventually monitor can connect to that wall. That's it. Thanks for watching.